Are we able to hear me? Just leave a comment. Okay. And are we able to see me? Okay. Okay. So how uh, how studying is going on? Yeah, good. Okay. Have you seen this circle? Yeah. Okay, right, Charlie. Yeah, right, right. Yeah, nice. Okay, okay, okay. I know everybody uh, who uh, like uh, who people are. Uh, I'm, they are watching my webinar. I know everybody. I remember. Yeah. Because today is uh, so sad. That already our room already pulled because uh, I think nobody can register again here because room is totally full because we have only 250 capacity, right? Yeah. Okay. So basically, uh, in my YouTube channel, I'm not creating like trading strategy. Like uh, when I'm giving this webinar, uh, so this is totally trading strategy, right? YouTube so I think four to five uh, YouTube video I posted there only trading strategies like that or rest of the other Ola market analysis video so today uh, I gonna give you like uh, breakout trading strategy so which is most important and uh, most professional that are using that one and the breakout trading strategy success ratio almost 90%. Right, trading uh, ratio. So most of the people are what exactly they are doing. Okay. Most of the people uh, like uh, suppose uh, this is the Mm, trend line when price is like running like that, running like that, running like that. When they break and suddenly they are here for the buy, right? And the most of the time uh, breakout, uh, again price reverse break and they form a fake breakout and most of the traders are losing money in this area. They are entering in a fake breakout. So I will show you by filtering how to enter uh, during breakout. So we need to focus on uh, like uh, seven criteria there or seven rule. So let me explain one by one. All right. First rule, whenever we are going to draw support or resistance, that support or resistance and lines should be tested three times. So basically I will explain two type of uh, breakout trading strategy, right? One is, uh, just a minute, one is horizontal trend line breakout and another is diagonal trend line, right? Diagonal trend line like that. So most of the time we are using this type of the breakout, right? So, first criteria, always remember when you are going to draw a trend line, the price should be tested three times, right? Yeah, three times, remember. So, for example, price came down, test one, not able to break, reverse back, test two, not able to break, reverse break, test three, not able to break three times. So we are looking for this type of trend line. Is it clear, right? 
time test one, twice, three. So that is perfect. So we are looking for this type of chart and always oftenly we are, uh, we have seen this type of uh, testing, right? I'll show you exactly. Next type, remember the candle body open and close above support or resistance, right? Similarly, let me show you here like that test one in a diagonal two and test and market is somewhere here like that, right? Test one, test two, all like that. This is called a diagonal trend, right? So next criteria, we are looking for a candle who remember we are not looking for this type of candle open is here is above right open is here open this area below this uh, resistance line and close are there we are not looking for this candle we are looking for this type of candle open and close should be above the supporting resi or resistance line so for the buy, we are looking for resistance. For the sell, we are looking for support. We are looking for this here open and the next close above. And remember, if lower point like tail, if break this uh, previous uh, resistance, now it is becoming a support here, it is doesn't matter, okay? Looking for open and close, that means a body of this candle should be above this support or resistance line. We are looking for this type of candle, remember. All right, is it clear? Criteria number two is, okay, okay. Next. Trend confirmation for the uptrend. Remember, we must confirm the trend. For the trend confirmation, we must focus on, suppose this is a 50 moving average, should be above right, EMA, all are EMA, right? All are EMA, okay, remember, all are EMA. I especially use all are EMA because uh, uh, SMA is two lagging indicator, right? So I'm not using SMA. Sometimes I use for find out the support and resistance. Otherwise, I'm not using SMA. SMA is two lagging. They are giving uh, uh, they are giving very late information, right? Remember, 50 SMA should be above 150 SMA. EMA, sorry, 150 EMA. 150 EMA should be above for the buy. For the sell, it is opposite, right? And at that time, 20 moving average should be Here is 20. And most of the people are doing it. I'll tell you, don't do that, right? And now you can see by using average, all moving average are arranging sequently. So I'll show you in a live chart, okay? Later, let me explain one by one. Now, you can see here 20 is above 50. 50 is above 150. That is, uh, uh, they are informing that trend is up. So we will go for buy, remember. And another, there is another option like here. Let me show you. Sometime, uh, like uh, price is running like that here, um, testing one, twice, third like that, and all moving averages are staying here like that, right? Showing like, and at that time, moving averages are staying out there. So in that case, we are looking for breakout 200 moving average. So I'll show you exactly what is the criteria here, right? No need to, uh, you, right now, it, it will be very complicated otherwise. So I'll show you in a live star, right? So uh, fourth momentum indicator 
a bullish signal, right? Momentum indicator, you can use any momentum indicator at that time, uh, a bullish signal, right? Okay. Okay. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll show you, I'll discuss about that one. Uh, all right. Now next you can see, place buy order high uh, breakout candle. So now you can see here, we have seen this candle broke the trend line, right? So if you wanna buy, don't buy. If uh, price is running here somewhere, people are entering in this, do not enter wait to break this candle at least five to ten point above you place buy order all right okay when you are going to enter in this 20 moving average should be closer right if 20 uh, here is a suppose here is a resistance line all right uh, testing here like they're running like that here 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 and after that they broke and if you see 20 moving average is too far from this area do not enter we are looking for 20 should be closer right do not enter in that case and sl always use sl at least one atr 1.5 atr right so how to use a uh, 1.5 uh, ATR? Suppose here price is running in this area uh, like uh, 10, then use 15.1, 15. Uh, 15. remember, I'll show you exactly how to use, all right? So let's jump to directly in our chart, right? So, make the super 10 rsi that is the another con uh, okay mr gopi yeah mm -hmm. okay. okay uh for the last time frame mr gopi trend are uh, still running in a downtrend for the like four hour and daily according to the moving average, all right? So trend is down and price exactly hit from uh, 200 exponential moving average and reverse back again, all right? Okay, I, I'll show you. So most of the people are, okay, okay, I'll show you. Okay, so let's jump to our live search some uh, criteria, all right? Now we can see, have you seen uh, like uh, most tasses point in this area? Here. Mm, this is crude oil and 15 minute intraday trader. Okay. So first I told, all right. So I told here first option. Uh, okay, let me explain this one. We are looking for 200 breakout, right? Or, or, or here, or 200 EMA. Even price also running like opposite, right? Let me show you. 200 EMA breakout. So now you can see, we have seen first swing point, second swing point, and the third point. And the fourth time we have seen here, they are testing. So let me draw a diagonal. Let me draw diagonal line here. So I just drawn by connecting. So let me change the color, right? This color is not uh, perfectly drawing. Let me show what color, uh, color, color, color. Okay. Doesn't matter, right? Okay, it's not visualizing properly. Red, okay, let me show red. Oh, visualizing properly, yeah, it's good. Let me a little more thicker. Okay, 
yeah it's perfect right so have you seen second option right first test test and reverse back again test we have seen second option second test price again fell down reverse back that trend line right third swing point reverse back again hit and reverse fourth we are looking for minimum three so after that most of the people are doing a big mistake here we can see let me let me show you right let me zoom a little more okay where is that exactly here i'm gonna draw here okay let me zoom sorry let me zoom a little more uh, now is it clear let me remove now you can see just a minute what happened that trend line just a minute okay i drawn it and then i can see here let me zoom all right have you seen this one this candle broke the trend line all right now we are not looking for this candle we are looking for next candle whose open and all are above resistance line all right so in that case we have to focus on this percentage r should be above this minus 50 line have you seen this is and they're confirming momentum candle are bullish now when they're confirming we will definitely go for buy and at that time we are using another indicator this is called parabolic sir should confirm us bullish right so here we have that uh, parabolic chart dot are forming below that candle so when they are confirming so we can go for buy and remember we will buy at least five to ten point above that candle because this candle open and above this resistance line criteria number one right and here most of the people are thinking all moving averages not arranging sequently yeah actually that is right but an another criteria at that time taking 200 exponential moving average so that is why we are going for pi now question is that where is our sl for the sl we are going to use atr right so how to calculate atr now you can see this is called atr so let me change just a minute. let me change that one let me use that atr right uh, somewhere here just a minute okay cool now you can see at that time here this candle right this candle early here this candle right so now i want to use atr i want to use here atr when they break in that area so in that case you can see atr was running around 13 right atr is running 13 so let me use calculator so here we can see uh, we're gonna use one three into 1.5 atr that means it is showing 19.5 point right that means almost you can say like 20. so our sl will be 20 point below right now most of the people are thinking i'm going to use from here 20 point not exactly where is the breakout point here where is the resistance line here right in this area 
our resistance line is here. Our resistance line is here, so my right. Here, this is our resistance line, but our anti right? Our resistance are here. And then now it's becoming a support, right? It is our anti point. We are not anti point. We are calculating from support. Now it's becoming a supporting line. Now let's check it 20 point from that area. It is our support line. Let's drop here 19 and 20 around 3786. Around 3786. Eight, six. Have you seen? This is our here, and SL will be here. That means it is showing 32 point right now. And our target. If you wanna use one is to two, that means if 30 point is your SL, then your target will be 60 point. Right. So let's check it. Here uh, it is showing around six, 76 point. Oh, we are looking for 60 point. Our target are achieving here. Right? So most of the people are using one is to one. Then our target will be 30 point same here in this candle. That means one is to one. Our target are somewhere here. One is to one and SLR here. This is our SL target and this is our profit target. And this is one is to one trading ratio who people are following. And somewhere here is one is to two trading ratio, right? So this is our SL. All right, is it clear? Let's check it. So let me zoom a little more. Now you can see here. All right, let me remove. Now, have you seen another uh, three tasks somewhere? Why you can be ATR by one? Okay, we use always 1.5 ATR. It's most comfortable we, uh, when we are analyzing like why I'm using 1.5. So if you use one ATR, that means same point sometimes, suppose, uh, this is breakout point and you enter here somewhere by enter. If you place one ATR, it is too small, right? If this is uh, like sideways mode, like no volatility, right? So in that case, we are using one ATR. When price is high volatility, we are using 1.2, oh sorry, one ATR, remember. Right, and have you seen another three process point? Process one, twice, and third. Have you seen? Let me draw a trend line, diagonal trend line, right? By connecting these three process point. Let me remove uh, from here. Now, have you seen? This is diagonal, right? Price reverse hit reverse hit reverse so after that there is a breakout candle this one not fully broke right open is below open is here and close are here so we are not looking for this candle we are looking for next candle open and close both are above this resistance line have you seen? Is it clear? Okay. So we have seen this candle open and close both are uh, above breakout point, right? So in that case, we are going to use by somewhere here above five to ten point above. Do not enter somewhere here by. Do not enter. Always place at least five to 10 point above, right? At that time, we must focus on our another criteria. Is it they are fulfilling 
or not. So let's take a look. Somewhere here, right? So we have seen momentum candle just broke and running above the 50, 50 right? At that time, this candle we have seen the parabolic are forming below. They are confirming they will go up, right? All filtering we uh, we are we are using all filter right by using momentum trend line moving average all now you can see moving average 20 above uh, 50 50 above uh, 150 all are arranging sequently so this is a perfect that is called high probability trade and remember there is no holy girl trading strategy in the world with 100 percent accuracy remember we are looking for high probability trade right this is called high probability trade all right and then now you can see uh, we already discussed uh, diagonal and now we are looking for um, what call horizontal is in some way here right now in this area we have seen this one higher point higher point higher point higher point, higher point. We have seen at least five touches point. Have you seen? One touch, twice, third, fourth, fifth. Price hit this area reverse back. Again hit, reverse back, hit, reverse, hit, reverse, hit. So we have seen five touches area in this, in this area around three, nine, six four right so we are looking for a breakout candle and all criteria are fulfilling here 20 moving hours above 50 moving hours and 50 moving hours are above 150 moving hours and at that time percentages are uh, above minus 50 level right so we are looking for buy opportunity here right let me show let me draw a horizontal trend line right now by connecting this most touches point, right? Have you seen? I just connected. Let's take a look. Okay, we have seen now. We are not looking for this candle, right? We are not looking for this candle because here open is below this resistance line. Have you seen? And close are above. And in that case, we are looking for this candle all open and close uh, above this is crude lighting recent data uh, this data around let me check it recent data this is crude oil around 24th october right it is very recent so we have seen this is a breakout candle right at that time we're gonna buy above at least five point above all right let's take a look how it should look like that have you seen boom after that price gone up from this area after breaking this area somewhere here i think placing our buy order or here somewhere and after that you can see like that right right this is horizontal backup trading strategy now similarly we are looking for and here right see here another more touches area at least three touches point are there right one twice third right we are looking for breakout candle somewhere here let's take a look either they are able to break or not this candle no after that we have seen after price drop down right so in that case later we have seen this uh, not this candle this uh, this is the resistance line have you seen this is the resistance testing test uh, some this is open is here close IR we are not looking for we are looking for this candle next candle have you seen let me show you next candle open and close both high above 
and our buy order are triggering somewhere here and profit. Is it clear? Okay, okay, okay. Just a minute. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Now, uh, some just a minute. Just a minute. Is it clear, right? Do I have any doubt like that? So uh, let me show you risk market behavior. I think yesterday, but I was not interested to buy yesterday. Price gone up. So according to the breakout trading strategy, we have seen process area are there. As reverse hit and reverse. First thrust. Okay. Second hit reverse. Third hit reverse. Have you seen? First thrust, second thrust, and the third thrust. Right. All right. And here, moving ever, uh, up, uh, sorry, percentage are momentum indicator are running above 50. Criteria number two. Using uh, for intraday, like uh, who people are uh, doing intraday trade, they are looking for one or two trade in a single day. They can use this strategy for 15 minutes who people are holding their position to one week, two week, or till month, they can use daily time frame. That is more accurate, right? Who people are using option trader use at least four hour time frame, right? High profitable trading strategy, right? So yesterday you can see, I'm not calculating this candle because here open is below this, resistant line yeah it is uh, like a apply basically i used in bank net because i am an option trader also right so next we have seen this candle and remember color of the candle doesn't matter right so next candle when they broke this resistant line it, it was bearish candle but remember color and somewhere here our buy order above this area Right after that price gone up, boom, right? So this is um, among my trading strategy. I basically uh, trading strategy, top trading strategy, second moving average bounce back trading strategy, right? Third, then continue trading strategy. All right, yeah, it's a bank nifty. So here we have seen, uh, this is called bounce back trading strategy, right? So every time i explaining when when i'm analyzing market so at that time i'm analyzing what trading strategy today i'm going to use right all right okay i'm using parabolic search seven for me so you just you can uh, you can use according to you doesn't matter whatever you are using but i especially use seven parabolic star right so when they broke here have you seen broke uh, parabolic star also bullish so you can go for buy right and let me show you crude oil because crude oil in a large time frame they're running in a downtrend right you can see here crude oil is running in a downtrend in a large time frame. Sorry. In a daily, you can see crude oil is running in a downtrend. All right. And four hour still running in a downtrend. People are, they broke that area. They're running uptrend because still running in a downtrend. Okay. Okay, I'll analyze everything one by one. Do you have any doubt here? You just ask me about the breaking uh, trend line break, trend line breaking trading strategy, breakout trading strategy. Most 
most of the people are using, right? ATR value is seven. I'm using ATR value is seven. ATR mostly used for final support. Uh, sorry, uh, stop loss. Most of the trader, 90% trader who professional trader always use ATR to place SL. Right. That means here we can see how we have seen breakout point here. Uh, this candle is breakout point, but uh, here, right? So let me show you again. Most of the people are doing big, um, wrong, wrong decision, right? So here we have seen, and at that time, ATR was running. Let me check it. Uh, what was the ATR? Right here we have seen the broke here. that time ATR was running around right eight eight point five or just a minute let me use properly exactly eight right so in that case we are going to multi uh, with eight into one point five sorry 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 eight into that means 12 point, right? 12 point. Now we're going to use 12 point, right? From where? Most of the people are calculating 12 point from here. From N do not put from there. Entry point is here, right? Do not put 12 point from where. You, you need to uh, place your SL. Where is our uh, breakout point and uh, now support? You just place 12 point from this area. Have you seen? This is our SL point light, 3852. 3852, 38. Like here. Right. So here our SL. All right. Do not place from this area. Do not count from this, your entry point. Supporting line, ATR. All right. Don't do that mistake. If you place from there, price will reverse, hit, price will go up, right? Don't do that. Always place SL from support or resistance line, all right? Okay. Percentage are 45, which is most important I use 45 days because the rest of the time they are giving fact point. Percentage are, right? So 45 period is comfortable for me. Uh, for intraday, I use 15 minute chart because I'm looking for only one or two in a day, not more than. If I'm not getting any opportunity in crude oil, I'm looking for zinc. If I'm not getting any opportunity, I'm looking for same strategy in a lead. If I'm not, uh, if they're not forming among my five trading strategy, I'm shifting to another skit. All right. ATR, I'm using ATR7. Average true range, I'm using seven. Right, all right, and percentage are percentage are I'm using 45 because this period are uh, indicating me everything breakout point, right? Almost so. Let's take a look. Uh, once they break like that, let me show you. Once they break here, have you seen? Once they break, price always goes up. Percentage R45. Have you seen this was percentage zero or minus 50 level? They broke in this candle. Price at least gone up uh, 30 to, uh, 40 to 50 point. Always remember that is I, I use. Here we have seen breakout. Price drop down, right? If you want to see, uh, previous market behavior use 
like let me show you in ATR, right? So directly, oh, sorry, percentage R. I'm not talking about it here right now. I'm talking about percentage R, William percentage R45 period. Yeah, right. Now let's take a look in my data and see when they're running. So always goes up. Right. Broke, price drop. Broke, price. Broke, price drop down. Right. It is most like uh, applicable for broke here at year, at year have you seen price gone up broke here price drop down broke this candle here somewhere price gone up at least 30 40 point here broke in this candle drop down right so now you can see broke in this area price boom from here but little more and again let's pay i'm using a filtering right so i just find out the, the pack point all right. Yeah, definitely. I am uh, like uh, yeah, definitely you can use uh, all technical indicator are used everywhere. Even when we are uh, analyzing uh, in forex market, at that time we are using all indicator, right? Because you can see here like that. Just a minute, somewhere like that. Uh, My head is a little more slow, I think, or my loading period is taking time. Market analysis, the uh, um, technical analysis somewhere here. Market analysis. So when I'm analyzing like yeah, uh, like overseas market, then at that time we are using. Have you seen? This is Euro uh, uh, Australian dollar. When we are using that time, we are using that uh, percentage R or something like that. And everything I'm, we are using. Have you seen? Uh, this is Euro USD. This is e right. We are using stock stochastic, right? This is German bond analysis. At that time, we are using RSI, right? And this is Nikkei uh, 225. We are analyzing. Uh, we are using everything, right? Stochastic, uh, uh, um, Aaron indicator, whatever. Here, Aaron indicator. Have you seen? RSI, right? Breakout trade. Yeah, I'm same like moving average. Whatever we are using, right? Basically, I uh, analyze uh, forex market for overseas client also. <coughs> Please upload video in you. Audio is clear. Yeah, so bank nifty, right? So let me show you in a bank nifty. So most of the people, even I, I also trade in option. Okay, how to take your subscription, sir? Okay, yeah, you have YouTube channel because I'm analyzing every day. All right, show me my YouTube channel. YouTube channel. My name is Dupen Gogoi, and here I am analyzing like oil or uh, something stocks, right? Uh, subscribe this YouTube channel. Same name, and you can see this is crude oil, crude oil, something like that. Crude oil trend line breakup trading strategy. You just visit to my uh, YouTube channel. I already and crude oil analysis. Here you can see LNT. Uh, this is LNT FH, right? So you will find. And basically, I never use this uh, like uh, uh, upload this type of trading strategy. Most of the my trading strategy are all are paid in available in U domain. Okay, you will get my email ID. My email ID is okay. I will write down just a minute. I'll write, I'll write. Okay, my. So let me type, how can I type here? 
This is my email ID. Send to all. Yeah, I always, uh, uh, yeah, daily I have post. Okay. And uh, my telegram is at the red. Okay. This is my ID. Okay, my home address one. This is my telegram ID. All right. Uh, my telegram is at We are uploading. Right. And you can visit to my uh, what call this one page. You just visit to my can learn how to analyze. Doesn't matter what I am analyzing. This is like a US uh, ten years uh, bond like that. Doesn't matter. You just visit to my website hornforfit.com and read how I am analyzing. Right. Uh, this is a CAG 40 analysis. How we are analyzing? You just go and read again and again. You just improve your analysis uh, analysis quality, right? And how we are analyzing this market? Uh, this is only for a US client because I'm focusing basically on US uh, uh, client. And right now, recently, I'm focusing on Indian client because. Uh, Indian, most of the people, new people like you people are interested in technical analysis and the rest of the whatever I have seen, they are focusing on fundamental, no, what technical exactly, right? So that is why I was focusing on US market, right? So recently I focusing on uh, Indian market, right? Or Indian people. You just read properly. And if you want to read various type of trading strategy like that, you just visit here and market analysis, technical analysis. I am already, I already posted here various type of trading strategy, how professional trader analyze in the market like the trading strategy. You go to trading strategy, you'll find various type of best trend line trading strategy, how to do position sizing and risk management how to become a successful trader. Uh, we need the like uh, trading system like that. How to draw support and resistance and go and read there. If you wanna read more about the indicators, you just click on indicator. All indicator are available. Bollinger Band, ATR read there, Stochastic, uh, RSI, CCI, Erlon, Parabolic chart, Moving Averages, you just read there. Everything are very uh, clearly. I'm writing here for uh, like new people can understand here, right? What price action trading? Uh, okay. Right. Already we discussed about the price action because you will find that price action methods, right? Okay. 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 Still, they come available, not available. Okay. 
Okay, Udemy course. Uh, that means uh, first uh, my course was too too costly, so for few days I just uh, removing there, and I'm writing uh, like uh, low cost uh, courses. Like first course was very so. Right now I'm writing like uh, la uh, for, for the new people, right? So their cost is too high. So recently again I will up upload everything. Okay. I'll give it uh, Udemy's uh, link, right? Yeah, I was thinking, but uh, I'm uh, handling uh, three websites, so I have to write content. So it is very difficult to upload again every day, right? Price action trading strategy is very most important trading strategy. You just visit their price, uh, price action trading strategy, how we are doing price action trading strategy. Because most, um, I think trading strategy, price action trading is the best trading strategy, right? You just learn how to trade with using price action, right? Webinar, okay, thank you. My website name is hornprofit.com. Hornprofit, this one, hornprofit.com. You just read there. Because everything I'm giving, I'm not writing very long or lengthy process. I'm writing very smoothly and very uniquely. So I'm writing like quick summary, how to trade, right? And break out like that. Very simply I'm writing for your better understanding. Yeah, thanks. Uh, what is the price? Price is very less. So price is very less. I'm just at uh, 300. So I'm, uh, I'm uh, my courses I'm segmenting, right? Separating differently. So it's very low around 300, 400, 300, 400 like that. First course was very costly, 11 or something like that. Most of the like new beginner uh, who are starting like uh, using their 30,000, 40,000, very difficult to buy this course, right? That is why I separated my course, right? They can buy like uh, some people uh, wanna buy like a candlestick pattern trading strategy. So that cost will be around 300, 400. Right, so and the two to three course, uh, it is costly. I think uh, fifteen thousand or something. No need to buy because I separated all of them. Right. Okay. 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 I'll show you my three website. I'm writing to market talk. Okay. My allies blue, uh, allies blue market talk all are written by me. Yesterday, I posted psychology and trading, right? Psychology and trading, and all are this is my another website written by Dipen Gokoi. This is my name and my profile. And by clicking, you will find me in my social media. This is uh, allies blue market talk, and another. Another website is Ant IQ. Now this is Ant IQ written by me. All website, whatever you click, this already I uh, posted here. Various type of uh, Fibonacci trading strategy. You just click on there. How to trade with Fibonacci or whatever you want. You read, and uh, this is my name, Dipen Gogoi, technical analysis. Scalp trading, day trading, swing trading, position trading, Fibonacci series indicator, trend, momentum indicator, volatility, volume, cycle indicator, Bill William indicator, all are written by me. Uh, candlestick pattern, chart pattern, expert advisory for our client. You just visit anywhere, candlestick pattern like that. You just click on there and click on hammer pattern or whatever. All are explaining. All right, and this is three website 
written by me. One is hornpoppy.com. This is my home page. This is my personal website. Okay. And this is uh, this is hornpoppy.com. You can see this is my personal website. You'll find stock trading for beginner, how to trade with and triple top, Iliot web, trend line trading strategy. All uh, available here. You and read right next uh, this is and market talk because every day i'm giving market talk morning talk before market open all about the global market here we can see this was one day ago i think yesterday i posted every day around early morning around uh, 7 30 i'm posting stock market drift Thursday, as new economic data shows a slowdown in Europe, on Europe and as in talk written by me. This is my three um, website. All right. Okay. Okay. So, all right. Do you have any query? Daily post crude oil. And telecom, yeah, we are posting telecom when trade bank nifty we was index of future. So basically, I'm a technical trader, so I never follow other. I always follow on technical. What technical tell us, we run with them. And believe me, I never watch any news and I never listen other. Analyze market directly. If technical are telling me just buy, buy. If they're telling me by right now, I'm not doing any trade, right? I'm interested to join tech analysis. Okay, okay, definitely. What uh, in your course, all are trading strategies, various trading strategies. So basically I'm analyzing, right, market. So in, I'm giving the various type of trading strategies, how to trade by using this indicator. RSI, how to trade using MACD, what is the market behavior, why MACD are forming this type of, when to not trade by using this, all are trading price action strategy, where can I find, you'll find price action trading strategy, I think, uh, because I'm running two YouTube channel, you know, among that one is my YouTube, uh, Defend Google, another is alliesblue.com, two YouTube channel I'm running. Uh, so I'll, I'll inform you where uh, you just leave a mail, mail to my mail ID, right? Already, already given. So mail, I, I definitely, I'll send the link. Course details, uh, so course details to tell the trading strategies. So here I have given this one like um, breakout trading strategy, right? various type of trading strategy, intraday trading strategy, swing trading strategy, long term positional by using various indicators. So does candlestick pattern work in crucial? Definitely uh, work, right? Don't don't confuse uh, this strategy are using only crude oil, this strategy are using like bank nifty or stocks, not like that all technical analysis are applicable anywhere. We are using US bond. We are using Nikkei. We are using same strategy in Euro USD. We are using crude oil, international crude oil. We are using in stocks, you know, every stock, not only we are using Indian stock, we are using Apple, Google, uh, like um, uh, 0.77, whatever stock are there, Alibaba, Amazon, whatever we are rated. Is it clear? Okay, okay, sure. Okay, definitely, definitely. I, I need to join, sir. Sure, Mr. Omir Neni Krishna. Okay. Uh, fish sort. Mm, fish. Miss previous three school class when I view them. Okay. 
Okay. Oh, okay, okay. I'll I'll try, Miss Narayanan. That one, sir. Uh, I another, sir. Definitely, 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 Mister Setterji. Okay, sir. I have miss previous trade view school class. Where can I view? So we must upload that one, or we must create differently. So I'll upload that video. All right. Uh, in our YouTube channel, do you know we are not providing any tips because a license holder? So my motive is to teach you people, and my advice always learn, right? I'm not talking you will learn everything in a month or day. You will just learn day by day, right? No, I'm not talking. To, about today, I'm talking after two year, three year or five year later, you will be a professional trader, right? Don't depend on other, whatever learn you, you just apply by using little more amount. Don't put your all amount, use little more amount and learn from that, right? And, and I advise don't take tips, even that is why I'm not giving any tips, right? don't don't try to take uh, tips because you don't know how what strategy are using there and most of the tips uh, yeah everybody knows about that no need to explain i'm not going to say others like bad other uh, about others right so you try to learn yourself it is better for you what is the fee for your course course is very uh cheap like 300 400 something are there right I need to do a course and interested join any price. So I'll 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 do today system. What are showing? Can I use stock day trading? Definitely, this is for day trading. You just change the time frame. Trading will be, will be different, right? For intraday trader, people are using five minute chart or fifteen. I uh, most comfortable chart are fifteen minutes. Right, always use 15. You just uh, use uh, one or uh, just uh, like uh, what call trade once or twice in a day. Right, 15 minute is enough. Right, if you are not finding uh, or not appearing this type of trading strategy, so you just uh, find out another chart. Mm -hmm. Okay, news, I never trade on news because uh, this is my view, I am gonna tell you that news, when news are coming, you, you never know about the news, right? And crude oil always coming positive, uh, but market running opposite direction, 90% according to the crude oil inventory result, right? And most of the, I don't believe on news. Uh, because most of the people who are sitting in CNBC or IBM like that, I don't think that people are trading or not, but I don't believe on, because I believe on data directly, data, behave, market behavior, right? Okay, how to buy course. So it, it is available in Udemy. Okay, I'll give it that my link. Okay, those words is positive. Okay, so you can uh, you can you can read that one in mobile also. Okay, do you have any queries? So I think many. Okay, right. Yeah, definitely, Mr. Rajendra Singh. It should work everywhere you can use because already one hour is over. Otherwise, I can show you in stock you just uh use in your stocks and if you are not able to find out then in stock you just leave a comment in my youtube channel right you just leave a comment in my youtube channel it's called depend go go i will definitely create by using uh analogy by analyzing stock 
by using this uh, trading strategy, right? Breakout trading strategy. My YouTube channel is Google with that one. All right, you will just find out, you will find me this one. D D N. And you just go in my, uh, you just go to YouTube channel, and search my name, you'll find me. You just uh, type in YouTube my name, Dupan Gogoi. You'll find me right in YouTube. Because I'm going various type of trading strategy in my YouTube channel. Don't trade when stocks, forex, whatever goes in sideways. Leave it the market. Okay. You just okay. Do you have any query? So already one hour is over because today is uh, uh, nobody. Uh, most of the people are not able to register because we have only 250 capacity. So uh, okay. All right, all right, all right, okay. So if you have any doubt, just leave a comment in my YouTube channel. Definitely, I'll 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 help you how to enter. Okay. Mm. That that is the evening evening session. So you just uh, subscribe my YouTube channel. So I'm trying to be live channel, right? You just subscribe my YouTube channel. I'm trying to be live in my YouTube channel, right? So you can directly you can talk with me during uh, trading session. So so I'm I'm trying to be live with you, right? All right. So thanks for giving your valuable time, and I hope. Uh, at least you learn something from this webinar. If you have any doubt, then you can leave a comment in my YouTube. Uh, in my YouTube channel. So definitely I'll help you, Mr. Rajas, how to identify retrace or reverse level. So uh, I have to create another uh, webinar, right? How to identify. Uh, I think time is or otherwise uh, it will take time to explain how to identify retracement or reversal, right? So definitely I'll create, you just, um, what webinar you want in next Saturday, you just leave my web, uh, YouTube channel. So definitely I'll create you. I'll create the best trading strategy definitely for you. So if you wanna know and go to my, YouTube channel and leave a comment what webinar you are looking for next Saturday, All right? So by the way, thanks for giving your valuable time oh, and I hope you learn from this webinar. So thanks.